That's what made this great cup possible. Um, when I was asked to oversee the Argos five years ago, uh, we had a couple of tough first, first years, my first two years, um, but I knew there was an Argos and a CFL legend out there that could bring us the culture we want. Um, it took a little convincing. Uh, I thank his wife, Diane, every day. Um, but like always, he answered the bell. And I am incredibly honored to invite our next speaker up here, our general manager. And this championship would not be possible without him, Pinball Clemens. to say this is one of the proudest days of my life yeah. and I in truth don't know quite where to start but I am going to try to move quicker than normal uh, this is a celebration uh, consistent with that, I, uh, well, I have to start at the top. And while we celebrate Mr. Larry Tannenbaum for so many reasons, I actually got a chance to see a photo of him. He looked like he was about eight or nine years old, and he was pictured in an Argo t-shirt with the Grey Cup. Yeah. And, uh, and so this has been a part of his DNA for a long time. But what I think is often left out of that equation is the best part of him. When I think of Mr. Tannenbaum, he's not complete without Judy. And every time I see her, the energy she embodies, uh, and she, she doesn't have to be out here in the cold today, right? That's a fan, that's somebody who is, who, who is for us, who's behind us, right? So, so we made the call, Larry, 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 Larry. Well, let's flip the script, today is, Judy, 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 Judy. If, if I can uh, go, keep going, I need to go a little bit quicker here. Um, Bill Manning asked me to do this job, and and I I told him no, and I, uh, I I I said that because I care about it so much, and um, I knew that I would get lost in it. And uh, for me, we played. Um, had 12 years to play and then coach for another seven or eight or something like that and and uh, I tried to then you know really dedicate myself to my family because uh, you don't want it said that your players see you as a father figure but your kids don't know you as a father and, and uh, so that part was very important to me uh, but in saying that yeah. In saying that, um, my kids are actually bigger fans than I am. I, so, 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 so they said, "What are you doing? Are you crazy? Take that job!" Right? And uh, so, I am very proud to be up here. And I want to say a thank you to all of our different component parts. This guy, Vince Magri, right there, right? Yes, that's my right-hand guy, right? Yes. He is the one who does all the late-night work, and then he makes me look good in the daytime, right? So he's the one that's up late. And the guy who is up just as late, right behind him, right? 
That is Mr. Alex Russell. Would you turn, give him a hand? Now, yes. yeah, they're both taken, so they both have girlfriends. So, but so, 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 but, but they're, yeah, they say that, but they're not married yet. So, so, I, I want to thank, thank the both of those guys, and, uh, I just become a, a grandfather for the first time. Yes. And she's sitting right up here. Yes, our little Carter Janae. Yes. I say that because the other guy I want to mention on my squad is, well, my right hand guy um, in terms of just mentorship and being there and he is uh, Jim Barker now I, I, I so our therapy team really want to celebrate our therapy team they are amazing yes. guys where's our media team doing media stuff they're doing media stuff so they're, so they're doing media stuff okay. Okay. all right all right good stuff and, and and now we have our our doctors that come alongside of our therapy team yes. respectfully respectfully to everyone else in our organization. Uh, I just haven't known you as long. This man has been with us 39 years. And because of our relationship, there are over, you know, 33 years that I've been here. Um, there's no one in this organization that I trust more, um, and and I trust deeply. Uh, but the just experiences that we've had together, um, and his consistency, and how much the Argos mean to him, um, just speaks to how much he means to me. And uh, so I just I just want to. So, so we uh, we also have our video team, who's headed by my right hand man's brother, John Magri. I, uh, I, I've already, all my time has already elapsed, but uh, I, I, my job today is to say thank you. Thank you to everybody. This, this media team that's been doing all of our social media is, is uh, phenomenal. And our, we have so many people that are working behind the scenes that, that really do the real work. And, and uh, uh, our job is to say thank you to them. Um, now I'd like to move on to say Okay, okay. We have this we have this little thing that we do, right? And what we want for everybody, everybody in the plaza, is to find your sweet spot in life. Yeah. Yeah. When I say sweet, would you say spot? Ready? Sweet! Spot. Sweet! Spot. Sweet! Spot. Sweet! Spot. Now, now this time with more passion, okay? When I say sweet, you say spot. Ready? Sweet! So right now, 
I'm getting ready to get to the sweet spot. I'm not going to point anybody out individually because we needed everyone on this stage to make it here, right? And so, two more things I have to do. The one is to thank this team because they are the reason. When I coached, the very first time I got a chance to coach in the Grey Cup, in that morning, you, you want to get that good speech in, right? Because before the game, right, it's too much energy. They nervous. All you do is yell. I don't know if people seen that little video that I did before the game. It's, yeah, it, I mean, it's cute, but it's unconscionable, right? It's, it's just, and they don't know. They're just yelling, ah, because they're ready to go. They're ready to play, right? But so, so before the game, in the, in the morning, that morning talk is actually when you can actually reach them and talk to them, right? And... Um, and that day I said, instead of me talking, I want you to talk. Because you don't win championships because of coaches or GMs. You win them because of players. Yeah. And so, right now, I want you to just go crazy for the next 15 seconds for the 2022 breakup champion. to honor the people who make it happen. The team has to win, but they have to be driven by something or someone. And that's you, our fans. As I close, I want to say that I think my greatest strength in life is I understand how important I'm not. And I mean that sincerely. When you get past yourself, you can do something decent in the world. You see, the very fact that I have a car creates congestion. The very fact that I own a home makes the prices of homes go up. The very fact that I go to the grocery store drives passes, uh, prices up. If all I ever do is take from my community, my community becomes depleted, right? It is the strength of coming together as community, of giving back. That's our greatest strength. And you, our fans, give us more than we can ever ask for. You. are what I like to say as